Hey, so listen, man, real quick, man. These motherfuckers are goofy, man. For real, they goofy. I ain't gonna hold you. Hey, I don't even really have no issue with milk. I ain't gonna hold you. I just thought he was hating. <laughs> That's all it was. Uh, damn man, Cena, I don't even have no issue with. You know what I'm saying? It ain't like I don't got. Like, listen, I ain't scared of no bees, man. But it's just annoying. It's like, I don't want to talk about this shit that's not going to change nothing. You know what I'm saying? It's not going to cause no, you know what I'm saying, open dialogue for, you know, shit to be hashed out and, like, considered or whatever the fuck, right? I'm not going to waste my time on something. Because I, I, I know I could do something, like, to get it talked about. It's just how much. You see what I'm saying? I know I could do it. But I'm not gonna waste an insane amount of fucking effort to get that to happen just so I could ruin some dude who's blind 15 seconds of, you know what I'm saying, fame with their little pole arm stunts. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not. And, and by the way, anyone who, like, when you know how when you, like, learn how to do flip tricks and shit, you lean on a rail? Like, you find, like, some railing somewhere? Like, like a lot of plazas, like where uh, supermarkets should be at, have them. They just lean on the rail and do the kickflips. Same thing as the game. But, uh, yeah, I'm just saying, I don't, I'm not pursuing any crazy beef with any milk or this damn man Cena character. I'm not. I'm just saying, the beef I have with Adam 22, that stands, obviously, but. I mean, it's like, I just felt I had to say this about milk to clarify. Because it's more about milk. Like, I don't give a fuck about damn man Cena. Um, milk, I just felt like was hating. And, like, I felt like, I, I mean, I didn't, like, get why. I mean, he got, like, how many subs and shit, right? Like, I wasn't hating on him. I still ain't. I still don't hate on that motherfucker. I hope he do well. You see what I'm saying? I just hope he, I hope it's not the way it looks. You see what I'm saying? And, and I feel like this... You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, I feel like I, I have a lot of mutual subs with him now. So, like, I have to say this. You know what I'm saying? Like, I still think, you know, certain, you know, things are, you know. But like I said, I've lived a pretty fucking, it's like, it's, I can't say it's exactly identical. But, like, the adoption, like, basically at birth, the fucking being raised in, like, a, a crazy environment, like, uh, like I said, like living, being the white boy in the black gang, like, you know what I'm saying, or what's looked at stereotypically a black gang. Um, like I, like I said, like I can't, I don't, this is the life I live, so I'm not going, I'm never trying to be up here trying to say he wasn't living that. But, you see what I'm saying, like when I felt like he was hating on me, it was like, okay, like fuck this motherfucker. But I want to make clear it's not not really like that you know what i'm saying so hopefully y'all understand this i just felt like i had to clear the air on that with damn man seeing you know, like i said i'm gonna leave that shit alone unless motherfuckers keep poking me with it because that's something i know i can evoke change with it's just a matter of how much am i gonna have to put into it and i really don't want to put all that much into that you know what i'm saying when i got music i'm doing and shit just, you know what I'm saying, to ruin some blind guy's 15 seconds of fame, man. No, nah, like, I want to let him be able to have that. But he's he's acting real fucking suspect. He's asking, he's acting suspect. But I've let it go. I'm trying to be grown about this shit. I let this shit go, man. And, and as long as, you know, nobody keeps trying to bring that shit up in, like, dope head style paragraph, you know, text. Like, listen, I used to see dope heads do this, right? They be nodding out. And they act like they were texting. They would be texting, but they just be texting the, like, longest shit, the most redundant, longest paragraph. They be typing a novel in a message. Like, I write some paragraphs, but listen, it's it's only for people I know is going to read that shit. And it's always relating to the topic of what I'm watching on YouTube with either some input I have, whatever the case, right? Now... When, when motherfuckers literally is writing like that to hate on motherfuckers, all I think about is like, when you had that dope head that came through, right? And all of a sudden, they, their ride was here, they had to go, right? And $30 was missing out your wallet? Yeah. And then they texting you like that saying, oh, I can't believe you would accuse me. Of, 
while they they got the 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 eight bags that they bought for with your thirty dollars and they're texting like this that's why they're texting that much because they're literally just on autopilot trying to not look like they're nodding out in public so they're just typing yeah that's that's the type of message i got just out of nowhere because i said i said hey i've done a few videos on this because someone someone uh rep uh replied and was like oh I, I i guess they sort of saw my point people gave my shit likes like they've seen like there's a science behind like i just said when you learn how to skate and do like kick flips and shit you lean on like some railing and you do the kick flip and it holds you in the air so you can get the motion you know what i'm saying it's it's a common uh practice for when you learn how to kick flip and shit <laughs> you see what i'm saying so that's why i'm like but I don't want to ruin his good time. I want to let him have that. But listen, y'all keep pushing me. That's something I know I could. I know I could end his his shit with that. You know what I'm saying? I got a whole shit that I just got on standby just in case. You know what I'm saying? Thanks, Steve Barra. Listen, I'm about this bitch. But I'm trying. I'm trying to do the right thing and clarify to y'all. I'm not trying to get in no extra beef. I have one beef. That's with Adam Twenty Two. I don't got no beef with AD. I don't got no beef with no Sharp. I don't got no beef with nobody else. Like, Poetic Flock don't need to learn not to say certain shit to certain people because that's going, that's not, that's that's a problem I used to have, but for a different reason, not because like, I feel like you have that problem, Poetic Flock, because you think you're comfortable with, 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 like, I don't know if you've ever been in a fight, and this is not to try to disrespect Poetic Flock, I want to make that really clear. I'm just saying, I know I had that problem because I was, I, I was constantly, a lot of times, I was the, the motherfucker who was the toughest motherfucker around. There's a lot of times I like that. Nah, nah. Keep in mind, Detroit was not like that. There's a lot of places it wasn't like that. But there's a, there's a few places where it was. And so, like, I would get real comfortable with being, you know what I'm saying, able to, to pop my shit to people and, like, threaten motherfuckers and shit, knowing they was going to do what the fuck I wanted to. So that when I got around, like, for example, when I was in prison, I was still moving like that. Just because in the where I was at in the sticks, I was the hardest shit moving. And, and so when I got to prison where I'm around shit that's moving harder than me, well that's how that's how I got jumped. You see what I'm saying? And I'm I'm humble enough to admit that shit. But uh you feel what I'm saying? Like it's the same type of shit. Um but yeah, I don't got no beef with no milk. I don't got no no beef with no uh no fucking uh what the fuck? Damn man Cena, I mean Damn man, she didn't seem to have beef with me, but I mean, shit. <laughs> listen, yeah, I'm gonna let it go unless you poke me too much. Cause listen, I what I just did, what I just put on hold and on standby. Listen, you don't want that. You don't want that scene today. I know it's bad enough. Someone like Steve Bear or something is, uh, you know, is, is who's like probably freaking. That's why I think keeps making them go at me. The fact that I have that receipt. Like, I think someone, because when you get involved with them sponsorships, it's like, you know how when you get a job, it says don't do this or that in the way, like, you have to be a certain way if you're wearing the company uniform. You can't do shit that's going, like, disgrace the company or whatever. I don't know if it's exactly like that, but I know the way he responded, it, it's it, like, you could consider it un, unprofessional and, like, disrespectful. And not to mention, it's a logic that is so flawed, like, I was like, yo, this is why I'm not Gen Z or millennial. This is why I'm very clear. Listen, I'm in that little overlap time period of Gen X. Don't lump me in with them. Because th that's some shit where it's like, 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 yo, you're, sorry, your parents told you you were special too much. Not like that's what it is with him, but that's what the type of tone it is. It's like, do you, like, how, how did you grow up? Did you get everything you wanted? Because you seem to think, like, if you just say... It's like this now, like when, I'm not going to get into it, but I'm just saying, it, it was like, really? It was the most tone deaf fucking thing you could have said in response to what I, and I try to be real nice about the way I said it. Listen, I think it's great we have blind dude skating. I just was saying what I was saying. If you want to push beef about, like I said, I got, I, I can make it happen. I don't want to do it. You see what I'm saying? Well, let him just ride out in the sunset with his little pole on. Listen. Milk, I ain't got no beef with him. If he hating on me, listen, I, I hope he I hope he understand like there's no reason for him to be hating on me. I still fuck with him, even if he hating on me. But uh yeah, listen, be easy, y'all. 
And I just felt like, cause there's like some, some common subs and shit here. And like, I'm tired of motherfuckers trying to talk to me about some damn man Cena. I had to do this to clear that. Man, I'm out this bitch. Love y'all, man.